So we're gonna be taking a look at the most aggressive canards you can get for your C8 Corvette Stingray. They come from ACS Composites and it's their latest product that is inspired by the C8 Corvette Z06. If you're looking for the most aggressive styling for your C8, this is something you're definitely gonna to wanna to check out. So let's go take a look at what's in this box. So thanks for tuning into the channel where we do product reviews, how-to videos, and the occasional car rally and car show, but all around the C8 Corvette platform. Today we're going to be talking about the most aggressive canards that you can get on your C8 Corvette, and they come from ACS Composite. Now this is their latest product that they've just released, and it's inspired by the C8 Z06 and the canards you see on those. Super aggressive, really stylish, and I'm really excited to be able to get one of these and put it on my C8 personally. I think it looks, I think it's going to look great. So let's take a look at what's in this box and then we'll go and talk a little bit more about this product. Nope, that is not the right side. This is the right side. Come on, here we go. I always love in like ACS's packaging. I mean, their packaging is so nice in regards to always being exactly well put like well put together and exactly what you would expect so all right so let's move that out of the way so so when we get so when we take a look at this box first thing we get is your instruction manual as well as some of the hardware that you're going to need to actually do this install uh, when you get it so we'll put that to the side and take a look at that in a second and get to what is most important in this box well, let's see what do we got So getting it out of the, so taking it out of the bag, so taking it out of the bag, take a look at this. So it comes in a standard carbon flash finish that will match all your different trims that you have. So it'll look, so it'll give you a very good OEM look with your, with your C, for your C8. And looking at the finish, I mean, it looks absolutely Fantastic, as always from ACS Composites, they do a phenomenal job making sure that the quality of not only uh, the molds, but the actual just finish in general is always top notch. It's a plug and play system that you put it on your car. There's nothing else you gotta do to it. So, and these are made out of PC Composites, which is high durability. They're meant to last the lifetime of the car with zero issues essentially. So it's gonna match very, very well with the look of the rest of your C8. And I love how aggressive this canard is. This canard is freaking huge. I mean, this is like practically a shovel that you're gonna be putting on the front of your C8 that's gonna be just scooping the air, creating a good amount of downforce at speed for just what the for what this is. It is definitely going to create a good amount of downforce, especially if you're thinking about tracking your C8. This is gonna be something that's gonna add not only styling, but actual true function to helping to maintain that traction at higher speeds on the track. So it's definitely not just for looks, this is functional in regards to what it can do. So it already does have attached the 3M taping and then it has holes, at, it has a hole for actual mechanical fasteners as well. So this is not only just held by, this is not just held by 3M tape, this is held with actual fasteners and we'll be showing you how to install this in an upcoming video as well uh, with, all, with all the details so you know exactly how to do it. But this is built so that it functions and it's gonna be strong and hold together. Even at higher speeds, like you're talking over 100 miles an hour, this is gonna stay there. And you won't have to worry about this part coming off. It's not like just a little, like it's not just one of those little canards that just kind of stick on to the side of your seat and don't really do much and they're just more for looks. This has got the whole bang with it that it is functional on top of being stylish pretty much. So, so okay, so we're gonna put this to the side real quick and take a look at the other piece. So taking a look at the other piece, and yeah, just another great finish on these parts. And I do really like the fact that when they did these double-sided tape parts, that they had the little bit of extra right here to basically be like a tear off. This actually, this is one of those little details, honestly, that ACS does that's real. I really do appreciate. It makes it for a much easier install that you're not trying to kind of make sure you put it on and it's just 
whatever, however you put it on, it's, it is how it is. They do give you the ability to be able to kind of like tear this, and like get it dry fit on there, have it on there, and then pull the tab to make sure that you're getting the best positioning possible for these canards and frankly for any of their other different pieces that they have. So they do this for all their different pieces. So I do appreciate that thought of mind of the customer of how they would install these on their C8. Um, and even just in general, every single time I've ever talked to any kind of Chevy deal, like Chevy shop or kind of aftermarket shop that is putting on parts on a C8 Corvette, they always tell me that they prefer ACS composite parts in regards to doing the fit. It always fits exactly right the first time. So it's why I really do appreciate their products and the level of design and engineering that goes into these is always something that I very much take it like, is something that I always very much appreciate. So, so these retail for $4.79, but they do have special sales that are going on that can reduce the price. And I think right now as a release of this video for $3.99 at the, at the airing of this video. So I think it's actually a pretty good price for what you're getting. I mean, these are really well designed. They are functional as well as stylish, and it's pretty straightforward on how to install these. And they work with any of their front splitters. So whether it's the 1VM, the 5VM, or the 7VM, it'll work with all of them. It'll work with all three of those different versions. Now, I do want to caveat that the 7VM, you do need to take that front splitter off temporarily to install these, and then you can reinstall them back on. So now that we've taken a look at the canards, let's take a look at what you get in, what else you get in this bag as well. So, so, so coming in the bag, you have your instruction manual to be able to go and do this install, um, which again, we're gonna be showing you in a future video detailed how exactly you're supposed to install these. It's really easy uh, and we'll walk you step by step on how to do that, so. Uh, along with the instruction menu, you do have these, um, you do have adhesion promoter for your double-sided tape areas, which is gonna be very handy. Make sure that you have very strong bond. So you make sure you have that, like that adhesion working exactly how it's supposed to, to keep these canards in place, not going anywhere. Um, you also have your rivets. So these rivets are anodized in black. So when you actually use them, you're not going to be able to see the actual place where the rivet sits. So, which is really nice that you're not gonna, like it blends in, it's gonna be very subtle, that you're not gonna notice that there's an actual fastener there that's holding it in place, like that's help to, helping to hold it in place. Um, so, which is, it's a real, it's these kind of little extra details that really do make this part stand out. So, so yeah, so you have your adhesion promoter and you have like three rivets. You have an extra, they give you an extra rivet just in case, but you're usually, but you're using one for each side of these, like for each of these canards essentially. So, so yeah, that's what you get in the box. So, so I'm going to stop talking and get these installed on the C8 so we can show you exactly how it looks. So let's get started on that. So we have installed these canards on the CA Corvette and they look absolutely amazing. So the install was not that bad. It only took about 30, 45 minutes to do. And 
honestly, like, and honestly, it's one of the easier ones that I've done so far. So definitely a DIY, like, definitely a do-it-yourself type of install with very little issues in regards to doing it. The only thing I will say is that when you do the final placement of the install on the canards, you need to make sure that it's flush with the grill bezel so that you don't have a bit of a gap. And I'll be showing exactly what I mean in the how-to video that's coming up in a future video. So. But over, but aside from that, really straightforward, really easy, did not take me that much time to do at all. Honestly, now that I did it, I could probably get it done in 15, 20 minutes, not even. Like, so very, very easy to do. And it looks, it looks super aggressive. Now to me personally, it doesn't look exactly like a Z06 canard because that kind of goes a little bit lower on the bumper, but I like how this one looks and how it's designed. It, it's, it looks like it's its own separate piece, but it's inspired by the Z06 canard. So for me, it's a very unique look that I really, really do enjoy. So, but what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I'm really curious to see what you guys think about this. And if you're interested, I'll have a link in the description below so you could check them out also. So we'll have a detailed how-to video coming up in a future video. When it comes out, you'll be able to see it right here. And if you're curious about any other C8 or automotive products, check out any of my product review videos for all your C8 or car needs. If you're looking for the most aggressive, what is it that I was trying to say? So this comes with an OEM finish and carbon flash. I love the jets flying around. It's cool to see the jets, but when I'm trying to take video and they kind of just ruin the audio, it makes it a little bit challenging. In any case, oh, okay. Okay, I think they're done. The price, they have a sell goal. And at least for the, and at least at the publishing of this, and at least at the publishing of this video, they have a sale. They have a sale going on, and at least at the publish of this video, um, and at least at the publish of this video, they did have like, and at least at the publish of this video. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. I've done this freaking line five, six times. Okay, let's try that again. Um, so that's what you get here. So let's take a look quick. So that's what you get here. So let's take a real quick. Blah 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 blah. Okay. So, and again, the plane's flying. <sighs> I gotta love, I love, I love playing like, I love these fighter jets. I just wish they did this at a different time than when I'm doing all of these trying to recordings. Because it does make it challenging not to have all these random pieces of audio. Because it does make it challenging for all these random pieces of audio just coming in. Like that. <sighs> okay. Literally about to try to like start filming this post review and plane. Really cool plane, it's one of those radar military planes, but in any case, I always, <laughs> without fail. Been quiet this whole entire time, but without fail. And then the wind picks up. Nah, it's whatever. Anyway, okay, so let me, let me do this video.